The beginning of all things is the Apirin, the boundless. Explanation. Anaximander's concept of the Apirin as the origin of all things suggests that the universe is not created from a specific element but from an infinite, undefined source. This idea challenges us to look beyond our current understanding and seek deeper, more expansive truths. In our own lives, it reminds us that the unknown and the limitless potential of the universe offer infinite possibilities for discovery and growth. Things come to be and perish through strife, in accordance with necessity. Explanation. Anaximander believed that the cycle of birth, death, and transformation is governed by the principle of necessity, where opposing forces are in constant conflict, leading to change and evolution. This idea teaches us that struggles and challenges are not avoidable but are necessary for personal and societal growth. Embracing difficulties and understanding their role in shaping who we become can lead to greater resilience and wisdom. The one who is unjust wrongs himself, because he violates the law of the cosmos. Explanation. Anaximander believed that there is a natural order or law to the universe, and that acting unjustly disrupts this order, leading to personal and societal consequences. This quote emphasizes the importance of justice, integrity, and ethical behavior in maintaining balance in life. It teaches that violating the moral law not only harms others but also ourselves, highlighting the interdependence of ethical living. The earth is flat, and the celestial bodies are at different distances from the earth. Explanation. While modern science has debunked the flat earth theory, Anaximander's observation about the earth and the celestial bodies represents an early attempt to understand the nature of the cosmos. It encourages us to approach the world with a sense of curiosity and to keep questioning our assumptions. The pursuit of knowledge, even when it challenges existing beliefs, is essential for growth and discovery. Man is the measure of all things. Explanation. While this quote is more directly associated with Protagoras, some interpretations link it to Anaximander's work in developing a human-centric view of the universe. It suggests that humans have the capacity to understand and measure the world around them, and that our perceptions and experiences shape our reality. This quote encourages self-reliance, critical thinking, and the importance of using our intellect to navigate life.